Your boy runner. Hey everybody. Hello. Hello. How does it go? <laughs> it goes great. It goes great. Welcome back to the channel. Ugh, that sounds so cliche. Welcome back to the channel, guys. <laughs> Don't forget to like, subscribe. What did it say? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Don't care if do. no. Hey everybody! Okay, so I'm finally feeling ready enough to make a video because I've been like really out of my element um last couple of days. So here I am. Everybody keeps asking, how to shoot if it's plastic? Um, how do you know if you have a boy snake or a girl snake? And uh, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> Um, the way that I do it, you can do it several different ways. You can get a probe, which I don't have one. Um, I've been looking for one. I haven't ordered one online. I have priced and researched a couple of them. Um, Amazon is probably where I'm going to get it from. But, um, yeah, I just popped their tails. I learned that from Billy on Mutation Creation. Um, I think it was Billy, Billy or Austin shout outs. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you what to do. So one second, bloop, bloop, bloop. let me go down here and find me a good one. Mm -mm. Somebody I don't play with often. Okay. So Ooh. here's Paul. What? He pooped. Ew. Ew. Ew, he did. Okay. So here is Paul. Say hi, Paul. He's a little black spot. Hi. I know. That's that's the banana in him. And it brings out those beautiful, vivid black. Um okay. Beautiful, vivid black spots. Anyway, this is a boy, and how you know he's a boy. Is because, and he's supposed to be a female maker, fingers crossed, and I just weighed them out and put them in my new um, app, Reptile Buddy. If you don't know about it, go ahead and download it. You can keep track of your feedings, your um, weight, height, you know, length, not what height, but, you know, length. Um, you can keep track of your breedings. You can calculate what... Your snakes will make reptile buddy. It's in the app store. But nonetheless, here we go. Okay, so you see that at that little opening? They call it the cloaca. Cloatia. <laughs> it starts with a C. <laughs> it's the little opening right there. So what you do is you give a gentle little push at the ring of the tail right here. And then you push firmly. He might pee on me because he did just eating shit um oh hold on i gotta do it this way all right so there we go we got little boy prongs <laughs> i don't know if y'all saw that but i'll do it um maybe because he just shit uh, I, it's coming out it just looks really weird i don't want to keep manipulating it don't do him then again. Don't do him then again. What do you mean don't do him then again? So, yeah. It's two little prongs that come out in the bottom. I'll have to show you a demonstrate another one. Hi, Hanky. Oh, sorry. <laughs> he feels a little full at the tail, too. Ew, gross. He might shit on me. So, see that? See? Okay, so, yeah. Um, really bad camera. But, I'm trying to get it to where you can see. Push it out. And it's like, oh my god. That's, it looks really gross. It's like, booty hole in boy stuff. <laughs> Say hi, Hank. Hi, everybody. That's Hank. 
Um, Hank is orange ghost, head orange ghost. Let me see my babies. Mama's not in the mood right now. I'm trying to give a lesson. The females, however, and she is in shed. Oh, you can tell she's in shed. Look at that nice pink belly she got going and how rustic her colors look. Ugh. We just love it when they go in through shade. Eh, eh, eh. She's getting big. All my females are like almost 600 grams, except for the babies. Um, and then there you go. That's a girl cropped out really nice. Two little prongs. You see that? Two little. I always say it's like, um, what you call it? It's like the plug the socket, you know, boys are like this and the girls are like the one you know the plug so when they do it it's like connecting yeah that part of her tail opens up and okay, allows okay, okay. for his tail part to open up and slide on top of hers and sit like that and then they just transfer their love stuff <laughs> love stuff so yeah that's um that's how you do that if you want another demonstration i don't know if i showed the first one but here's donnie hi donatello donatello felicia is sleeping right now that's Mom. why she's not entertaining in the video and partaking in this particular sediment i mean segment but, um, yeah, so you take them, and you pull them, and you see? <clears throat> there you go. That's a boy. You see those little red? Yep. That's definitely a boy, and he's definitely almost there. I don't know. My camera. All right. I'm not going to hold him too much more like that. He's probably going to. It doesn't hurt him. I was going to say he's probably going to, but it doesn't hurt him. I mean, unless you're like really pushing down and then you start squeezing all of their... In you can give them hemorrhoids too. Yeah, they can get hemorrhoids. I had one die from a hemorrhoid. Her name was Esmeralda. She was, um, she was an orange dream, a beautiful high-intensity orange dream. And... Um, I think we fed her a meal that was too big and she tried to pass it and her her booty hole fell out and she died. So watch the meals that you give your snakes and that's how you pop your snakes to check if they're male or female. So nice big old red stuff means that they is boys. And, hi baby. And, um, pop all chills. am I going to pop them all? Nah, I just wanted to do one more. See, see, girl, see, that's a girl. <laughs> um, but yeah, I love my babies. They're awesome or whatever. So, that's the lesson for today, guys. I hope you enjoy this video. I will um, come back with more of your questions or answers to your questions as I feel and deem. I just wanted to pull them all out because <laughs> those are the babies. That's what you guys come for is to see the babies. And Can she's a girl, too. No, this is Duchess. Duchess is kidding. one of the smaller ones. She is in the 200 and I think she's 256 grams. Um, so she's one of my smaller females. And Keisha is also one of... Then her two. Mm -hmm. Every time. 
Um, but yeah, she's also one of my smaller males, uh, females, but she is actually bigger, I think, than Duchess. I think she is at 284 grams, which is um, pretty surprising. It's pretty surprising considering that she was fresh, fresh baby. Like she still had umbilicus. So, hi, mama. Want to say hello to the people? Say hello. 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 Hello, guys. Hello. <laughs> All right. So that's it for today. If I think of anything else interesting, I'll come back to you. But for now, thanks for watching. Peace.